Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing? <clears throat> Aries, this is Positive Thoughts and Energy. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Whenever you come across this reading, I hope everyone is staying safe. To all of my subscribers and my new subscribers, I love you guys. Thank you so much for your warm energy. Thank you so much for your like and share my content. It means a lot to me. To new viewers, cross watchers, come on in. Take what resonates, okay? And leave the rest for someone else. So... To, um, Aries, as I was shuffling, pre-shuffling your cards, okay? Um, th the cards just fail. All of the cards fail. So Spirit Guys is telling me that Spirit, that, uh, Spirit is saying, um, it's time for you to lay the cards on the table. Because as I was shuffling, it just fell. So whatever it is that you need to do, it's time for you to do it. It's time to just put it out there. It's time to just lay the cards on the table. It's time to go ahead and confess. It's time to go ahead and speak trueness. It's time to go ahead for you. If you like somebody, tell them. If it's somebody you interested in, tell them. If it's something that you want to get started in your business, start it. It's time to lay the cards on the table. It's time to start. Let's find out. Let's see what's going to come in the reading. Spirit guys, this is for Aries. Yeah. It's time to reflect. What is it that you need to start? It's time to get it out there. Look in the mirror. Look in the mirror. Don't you believe in yourself? Look in the mirror. Don't you think you're worthy of it? Look in the mirror. Don't, aren't you value? Don't you think you're high value? Okay. It's time. It's time. Tell me more, spirit. Okay. Let's see. Movement. Yeah. Movement. I feel like some of you are frustrated. Okay. But you also have movement. You're moving forward. Spirit said, it's time. It's time for you to lay it out, okay? Because you got it. It's time for you to lay it out. Don't you want abundance? Aries, don't you want abundance? It's time. Spirit God says it's time to lay it out on the table. You want abundance in your life, in all areas of your life, whether it's relationship, your health, or career, okay? It's time to lay the cards on the table, all right? Your abundance, you have abundance waiting for you, Aries, Comfort, okay? You have abundance waiting for you. You have comfort. It's you're gonna be you're gonna be fine. Some of you you're frustrated, but spirit guys is going to give you comfort. You're gonna have comfort through this process. Where did that card go? Let me get it. Hold on. Yeah, you have good energy. Okay. So go for it. Go for it. You never know until you go for it. Aries, this is for somebody. Spirit guides, tell me more. It's time to lay the cards on the table. Okay. You've been thinking about it. All right. You've been you've been thinking about it. Look at here. You've been sowing seeds. Okay, you waiting for it, but you you gotta you gotta uh go for it. You you you, you got you can't be waiting around. Life is too short. Stop, stop standing there thinking about it. Stop standing there thinking about it. Do something about it. Do something about it. Absolutely. Tell me more about Aries. Thank you. Okay. Tell me more. Yeah. So I see that you've been, you've been searching. You've been look, look, look at all of this abundance and stability. You've been searching. It's like you've been looking online. You've been, it's something that you've been doing. You've been, you've been looking, you've been, you've been, um, really thinking about it, contemplating. You got the 10 of Pentacles. You got the abundance. You got longevity. Whatever this is, Spirit God said, put your cards on the table. It's time to put your work out there. It's time to go for what it is that you want to go for because you got longevity. It's something you, you've been looking online, you've been researching, you've been, you've been really thinking about it, but you ain't been doing it. And I'm telling you, Spirit God say, put your cards on the table. It's time to get started. You got abundance. You got, you got, if you don't do it, Spirit God say, if you don't do it, the Spirit Divine Universe is going to knock it off. It's going to give you something that's going to knock out of your life. It's going to give you nothing but a choice but to go forward and do it. That's what the Tower card is there for. So if you don't do it, you're going to be pushed, okay? I feel like it's something that you, you are delaying. 
Some of you are delaying. Some of you can be you in the eye of people look up to you. Look here. You could be on some type of platform. You could be a counselor or a mentor or something, but you are delaying it. You have to chair it in reverse. You delaying your gift. You delaying what it is that very thing. OK, some of you can be traditional, old fashioned. You got to come out of that. You got to have an open mindset. OK, you got to go for your abundance. OK, and your when abundance is just not money. Abundance is longevity. Abundance is relationships, your health. OK, a job, your career, something that's going to last through your lifetime and your children's lifetime. OK, but I feel like you're delaying your platform. OK, you're delaying it. And spirit guys is is saying it's time to lay the cards on the table. It's time to lay the cards on the table. Mm -hmm. It's time. Thank you, spirit. OK, justice is in your favor. It's time to do it. It's going to balance you. It's going to balance you. Now, see, when we hold ourselves back, look, yep. I just said it. When we hold ourselves back, a lot of you have an anxiety and fear about starting this platform, starting this counseling career. Okay. You are having anxiety, fear. All right. And you're afraid to take a leap of faith. Listen to me, Aries. I'm talking to somebody, a quite few of y'all. Let me tell you something. If you don't start from somewhere, you will you will go on regretting the rest of your life. You have movement. You have and you frustrated. What are you frustrated about? You frustrated because why? You're scared. You have an anxiety. You have a gift. People look up to you. You need to use it. Justice is on your side. It's going to balance you. I can be. You can have Libra in your chart. But you have fear. You're letting fear and anxiety hold you back. You're not listening to your intuition. Whoa. You're not listening. Look at here. Will of Fortune is on your side. Can't make this up. Now, this is something that's, you're going to regret it. This is something the divine, this is destined to happen for you. This is something that's, Will of Fortune is all... You know, good luck, good fortune coming back around to you again. Okay. It's a, the, the will of fortune can also mean a missed opportunity in the past where you did not, you missed the opportunity maybe to do this very thing that you need to do. Maybe you was just not on the right path at the time, but see now divine God universe is bringing this will this will is turning again giving you another opportunity to do it okay now if you don't do it then that's when that's when the divine universe god gonna step in and gonna start knocking things out your life and you gonna have no choice but to do it an example Say, for instance, that you're working and you know that this platform, your gift, that people look up to you, that you can make money and everything, whether it's YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, whatever. And you're not OK. You're not listening to that. OK, but you're going to work every day. See what divine universe God will do. It's caused that job, caused you to lose that job. And then you got to be pushed and forced to start something because you're going to need the what? The finances. So spirit guys, divine is saying, okay, Aries, I'm giving you this opportunity to do it yourself because this is destined for you. This was predestined before you came out of your mother's womb for this time and place for this to happen for you. But if you continue to ignore it with the intuition card in reverse, you're going to have some regrets with the five of cups. You're going to regret this situation. Spirit guides say it's time to throw the cards on the table or you're going to regret the situation. Now, this is something to do with a present past, something recently 
that you know you need to do. The Six of Cups can be past life or it can be recent past. Something that you know you need to do that you don't put off maybe a couple weeks ago, a month ago, two months ago that you don't put off. And you know you need to pick it back up. You put it, you delayed it. You pushed it to the back burner. Okay, I'm talking to somebody. You pushed it to the back burner. Spirit God said, okay. Now I'm giving you, this is predestined. This is what's supposed to be in your life. But if you refuse to ignore it, ignore your intuition, okay? I'm going to have to call something to be knocked out your life so you have no choice but to pick it up. Now, if you don't, Spirit Guys is always also saying you're going to regret and you're going to miss a beautiful opportunity to have abundance in your life. Okay? So, this is for somebody. And I have to explain it so you can understand that you are predestined to do this. Okay? Queen of Swords. It's time. You know it's time. It's time to it's time to cut out the BS. It's time to let go of people that's full of BS. And it's time to go towards you're gonna have to cut those people out. Those people that means no good. And you're gonna have to go towards your destiny. You're gonna have to go towards your destiny. Okay? You have the page of wands. You're going to have to go towards your destiny. Spirit guides, tell me more. For Aries. Okay. You're going to have to take a leap of faith. It came out twice. The first time it came out in reverse. This time it came out that some of you are about to take a leap of faith. See, from two different decks. Some of you are afraid and not going to take it, but some of you are going to go ahead and start this new beginning, this new channel, this new stream of money, this new passion that you have, that you know you're gifted with because you over, you think about it a lot, but you're just afraid. Okay. So spirit guys are saying it's time to end the old cycle and start a new cycle. If you don't do it, the spirit got to go to the anxiety card. Fear. Fear is really in your way. Fear is in some of y'all's way. If you don't end it, divine universe, God is going to make it where you're going to, you're going to regret it. They go to, they go to, no, I can't make this up. I can't make this up. Here go the queen of swords twice. Spirit guides say, cut it out. Cut them loose. Two different decks. Cut them loose. Aries, cut it loose. You've gained a lot of wisdom. You can have Virgo in your chart. You've gained a lot of wisdom, a lot of insight. Very, very, very intelligent. Okay? You could be young with a lot of wisdom. And it's time for you to go for what you know. It's time to lay the cards down. And it's time for you to end something that you know you need to end and take a new leap of faith. Start this new business, this new YouTube, this new whatever it is, because this is what you were brought on this earth to do. Okay, this is the contract that you signed before you came to earth that your gift is to mentor, to speak to people. Okay, you need to go for it because it's going to pay off. Spirit got your back. Don't worry about that. Spirit got your back, Aries. Any other message for Aries? Any other message for Aries? Any other message? Thank you. Any other message? Thank you. Fear. Fear of the unknown. You're wondering, what if it don't? But what if I don't make it? But what if I can't? Or what if it doesn't pan out? What if, but what if you don't try? But what if you don't try? That's the question. Moon is all about secrets or fear of the unknown. 
Yeah, you manifested this. I can't make it up. You manifested this. This is what you wanted, right? So the divine universe is telling you, is giving you the green light to move on it. The green light to move on it. The green light to move on it. Move on it. Abundance, 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 abundance. It's time to move on it. Don't you you manifested this. You did this. Do you want it or not, Aries? See? Do you want this love? Some of your lovers. Do you want this love? Do you want marriage? Lovers can be friendship, can be partnership, it can be. Do you want it? You're very defensive. Look, you're going to be stable, stability. But your defense, and you're going to have to, you know, you have to protect your territory. The spirit guys are saying, look, boss, you're about to be in authority. These all the signs and signals and, and what that the spirit guys is throwing at you. That this is your movement. This is your time to start whatever it is that you've been delaying. Charity in reverse. You've been delaying. Spirit guys said it's time to start it or you're going to regret it. Here's the card right here. You're going to regret it, the five of cups in reverse. You're going to regret it if you don't start it. Aries, I'm Paul's of Thoughts of Energy. Until next time.